Welcome back everybody, Derek Sue, your East Oakland Advocate. Well, today what I want to talk about is 911 and Oakland police response. Okay, Shang Tao did come through, as she said, at getting the 911 calls, uh, the responses down. And so uh, I'm using an event that happened Saturday morning at 7.30. And I called 911 for a police response uh, because there was a threat. I was threatened out on the street. Uh, and I didn't want this to escalate. And, and so anyway, I made the call to 911, told them about the threat, who made the threat, and uh, what it was about. <laughs> and so that was at 7.30 Saturday morning. And the 911 operator actually picked up in, uh, in under 30 seconds. And that's not bad. That's a great improvement compared to where it was, which was about 20 minutes before. And so with a 30 second response, that wasn't too bad. Um, and then the 911 operator said that uh, she was sending a a police officer to uh, talk with me about the incident and, and uh, try to resolve the situation. Well, I had figured that Oakland Police Department, um, they're not going to show up, period. And this was Saturday morning on a seven, at 7.30 a.m., not at night, a.m. <laughs> so this is just past when everybody, the change of shift. Change of shift is typically uh, at six o'clock in the morning. And so a fresh crew should be on the street. Well, after waiting five minutes and it was just getting ready to start raining, I just said, screw it. I'm just gonna go walk through the problem. And if I have to you know, deal with it another way, then it will be resolved that way. So anyway, got back and um, two hours later, I called 911 back and said, hey, I still don't have a police officer. I walked at home uh, without your escort because you guys didn't show up. So, um, and, and on that call, the operator picked up on the second ring, two rings, that was amazing. Two rings to get a live 911 operator. And that was Saturday morning at 9.30. And she said that, uh, um, do I still want a police officer to contact me? I said, yes, I want a police officer to contact me. And I did this so that I have it documented and I'm now the clock is running. The clock is literally running to see how long it takes for a police officer to respond. Well, that was Saturday morning at 7.30. All the way 24 hours later, I was back out walking the camp and reported 911 uh, an actual theft over there. Uh, two characters is stolen um, a white uh, industrial uh, commercial van with tools and equipment. Uh, looked like an electrician's van, and they were stripping it. Called 911, said, this is in progress right now. Described the characters. Uh, none of the stolen vehicle had no, had all the plates torn off of it. The vehicle that they were throwing everything into, no uh, license plates on that one, broken windows, and it was a green Dodge Caravan. So I gave all the information to the police officers, and there's, they said they're going to send people right away. Well, I stood there for 15 minutes until both characters drove off, and no police officer showed up. And on that incident, uh, that 911 call, uh, on Sunday morning, they responded in 15 seconds, the time limit the, that uh, uh, our government puts as the, the clock. Uh, 
where they should be picking up. 15 second pickup time. And they actually had that. They met that on Sunday morning. But again, Oakland response time is zero. And they didn't show up. The criminals continue to um, have their, their fun and stealing everything from the city of Oakland and its residents and businesses, which pisses me off. Uh, because I have a business literally around the corner, and if characters like this were doing this, um, I tell you, I wouldn't need the police to take care of them. You know, I just go ahead, you know, they're, they're stealing my stuff, they're on my property, I'm going to do what I'm going to do, as you should be doing too, because Oakland police are not doing this, they're not coming to help you, they're not coming to save you, only thing they're going to do is if you're still alive, they're going to hand you a piece of paper with some numbers, and that's it. You're just going to have an official uh, document that documents the crime that just occurred to you, and there's not going to be any help. So you need to be watching your own back because Oakland and this current administration isn't watching anybody's back. Thanks for joining me today. <laughs> this is pretty pathetic. I just, at 12.31, the police were here. 12.31, I was notified that the police are outside. I'm not going, I didn't respond because there's no need to. The uh, incident was long since uh, um, de-escalated and we do have a problem there, but we're going to have other, uh, we're going to test other city uh, departments to see if they're going to be uh, interactive with the neighborhood and the residents here. Thanks for joining me today. <laughs> 53 hour response, 53 hour response time to get a police officer after the 911 call. Thanks for joining me today. This is sad.